Hello and welcome to our very quick overview of our configurable strategy automator EA. Okay, so this is the control panel for the EA. We've got all our news events and the EA can take action as the news events approach. We've got our built-in indicators showing you the direction the market is moving in on different time frames and how many pips it's moved in that direction. We've got the average daily range, we've got the spread, we've got the ask and bid prices. We've also got all the support and resistance lines and pivot lines and they're really important because the price can just bounce off one of those lines so it can be a good point to uh, set for a break even or to do a partial close and of course the EA can can do that for you. Okay, so we've got our hidden stop loss line. Uh, what we can do is uh, it's on automatic at the moment. What we can do is to switch it to manual. So these are all the controls for the sell. Got the controls for the buy so that you can do hedging. And if you move the stop loss line, you can see the take profit lines here are moving because they're set to a risk reward ratio. And they're actually set to scale out. So it'll scale out 25% when it reaches that line, 50%. Obviously, that's all configurable with this pop up. And you can actually get it to uh, raise the stop loss to break even when it reaches the first time. It. You can also get it to start trailing the stop loss when it reaches the second and so on. And that stop loss is used to calculate the lot size based on the percentage of your account you want to risk, which of course is fully configurable. We also support hidden pending orders, so you can just switch those on there. And you can get it to either alert or actually open a trade when the price is reached. So you can just set the line directly on the chart, it automatically switches between a limit and stop type. And then if you open a trade, just click that sell button there. Uh, what you can actually also get it to do uh, is uh, get it to scale in when a certain price is reached as well. And you can see our close and scale in buttons have appeared. Let's close that down. Now the big part of the system is that you can actually configure it with your own trading rules. So you notice these boxes down there, that's coming all from our built-in uh, rules engine. What you can do is configure your own rules. Now this is something we actually help you with, so don't worry about this too much. So my rules, and rules that involve how many or what indicators do you want to capture and what time frames, what on-screen controls do you want, and also the rules themselves. So imagine we're capturing three indicators, perhaps want a couple of tick boxes and maybe a button to be able to control the rule. We've got edit box boxes as well. GUI rules, that's if we press a button, uh, the GUI rule can be uh, executed to handle whatever that button press does, and then sort of number of... Uh, Entry and exit rules that creates a text file uh, which will appear then in your data folder under uh, that directory there, files. But don't worry, we can set this file for you, so don't worry too much about this. But it's just a matter of filling it out with what indicators, a bit about those GUI items. The rules, it's a bit like if you wrote them down on a piece of paper, but it's a very powerful system. And even if your rules are quite complicated, we should still be able to implement them in the system. Then if we click use as default, it's going to switch over to your rules. You can see already these tick boxes now have appeared and obviously you would you would label these properly in that text file and then it's ready to go and to activate the rules you've got the mode switch where it can just alert you when your rules line up or it can actually take the trade for you and that can be one off or it can be continuous. We also support multiple accounts where you can replicate your trades across uh, different accounts. So you may have accounts with different brokers. You perhaps want to try out different uh, risk percentages on the on the different accounts. And the way it works is you just declare one of the instances of the EA on one account as a slave, and then on the other account you declare that as the master. And then whatever you do on the master account will get replicated onto the slave. So you can just open a trade. And this works much better than a trade copier because with a trade copier he has to see the trade open on one account before it can then copy it to the other account but with this system as soon as you press the button that message then gets immediately sent over to the other account and potentially they're open pretty much at the same time so you get less slippage and so on and then obviously you can just then close a trade and you can have as many slave accounts as you want as well and of course there's lots of other features as well so for example if you do open a trade it will actually set a broker stop loss but it's just deliberately further away so that should put it out of the range for the broker to be able to uh, trigger that say with a spike on the spread plus all our hidden stop loss hidden pending orders they always work on the bid price so they're not affected by a spike in the spread uh, we also do login as well where we write a CSV file uh, with all the execution times and slippage which is very useful you can get it to do screenshots as well you can get it to do push notifications to mobile and there's a lot of polish there in terms of uh, checking that the spreads not too high before it opens a trade there's lots of error handling all the things that you need for live trading 
So hopefully you can uh, appreciate what the EA is about. It's got all the polish and capabilities of a ready-made EA, yet it's fully configurable so you can set it with your trading rules and you can set it with whatever indicators you want to use for those rules. Well, thank you very much for watching our other videos. We've got the full product tour where we take things a bit more slowly and you can really get a sense actually of how to use the EA with that video. We've also got our Truth About Brokers video where we explain the reasons for the hidden stop loss, hidden take profits, pending orders, and the reason why all our software just uses the bid price so that uh, your trades don't get knocked out by spikes in the spread. And if you need any more information or help, then please email us at support at runwisefx.com.